seven days a week, always adventurous, always uh, positive. A local sailor who died back in 2018 will be honored at next year's Rose Parade. Our ABC 10 News reporter Leah Pazetti shows us how his family is teaming up with a local organ donation organization to help honor him. <laughs> well, at least it'd be on something big yeah, kind of far away. So. Yeah. The finishing touches are being put on this picture. The floor graph is what they're actually going to put on the float for the Rose Bowl Parade. Shantae and Robert are wrapping up the image of their son, Robbie, who they say was as adventurous as it gets. Everyone would gravitate to his energy. He was just a positive, you know, daredevil risk taker. The Navy sailor served as a damage controlman on the USS Bunker Hill, but was killed in a motorcycle crash in 2018. His legacy carrying on even after he passed. And we heard a lot of stories after he passed away. We didn't have any idea um, that he was that influential with his peers. And that continues today. Some of Robbie's organs were able to be donated with the help of life sharing, meaning he saved five lives after he passed thanks to his heart, kidneys, lungs, liver, and pancreas. This year, his photo will be one of the many faces on the Donate Life float in the Rose Parade. They had heard so many stories about him and they wanted to honor him. And I said, of course, he's our hero. And if he want, you know, they wanted to honor him, we would be more than willing. His memory now living on in the five lives he saved and in the hearts of those around him. And he lived every day like if it was his last. And he told us all to live that same way. A lesson his parents now carry with them. Leah Pizzetti, ABC 10 News. Truly a lasting legacy. This year's Donate Life float will feature a large lion holding a book that represents the knowledge of knowing how important it is to become an organ donor. As always, the parade will be held January 1st in Pasadena.